Hey, uh, dear admin. So here I will guide you like how can you create Google Map API for the MSL. So first of all, we need two APIs. One is for the front and one is for the geocoding. So what we need to do first, we have to log in with console.cloud.google.com. Once you log in here, when you click on this drop down, if you have a project, then you can select that or else you can click on the new project and create a new project based on the requirement and you can set the location and organization for you okay here I have already a project so I can select that project after selecting the project here under the drop down okay we have to go to this hamburger navigation and go to the API and services once we are going inside API and services you can see here enable API and services option is there you can click on that link now you can select here two apis one is map javascript api so here you can see or else you can find it from the here like maps javascript api okay so it will display like this you can just click on that and enable that api once the api is enabled you have to go back to the APIs again and select one more to enable it. I will let you know. So here the JavaScript API is enabled now. Here we go. Okay. Now we have to select one more API that is the geocoding API. Okay. So So here you can see this is geocoding API. We have to enable this as well. So we are just making it enable. Okay, so this is enable now. Just make sure confirm uh, with your API. One is a JavaScript API, map JavaScript API needs to be enabled. This one and one geocoding API enable. So both APIs are enabled now. Now what we need to do, we have to go to the keys and credential. In the keys and credential you can see one key is already created that is the map api key okay so we need to open that api key here this is the api key which we need to add inside the maps api here okay and under the restriction under the restriction in the website you can add here your domain for example if your domain is circlestudio.co then here you can add like star.circlestudio.co1 then add again star.circlestudio.co slash star okay after that you can add for example forward slash star and one more without forward slash okay so here it is like we have instruction here as well if you see like your star dot your domain dot com then star dot domain dot com then your domain dot com and your domain dot com slash forward slash star okay so that is the instruction here as well with the page of map api so you can just copy it from there as well so this is the one thing okay you have to add four different domains here that is the thing and now save it after saving you have to create one more credential api which is for the geocoding so here it is we have to enter that geocoding api here so for that we need to create credential here click on the API key so you can see here the API key is created copy that API key and paste it inside the geocoding API okay now this geocoding API is needs to be restricted by this IP address so we are just copying this IP address from here you, in the instruction here it is so you can copy it from here as well just go for the API keys and 
here is an IP address destruction. You can just click on plus sign and add that IP address here. That's it. And save it. So now the geocoding API and map API both are working for you with your store. If you have a my Shopify domain, okay, for example, your domain URL is uh, like my Shopify.com. Here it is. Okay. Then you have to add this domain inside your web API like the first one maps api key where we add the domain if you have a restricted by the my shopify domain then you have to add it like this my shopify.com add and my shopify.com forward slash so if it is like if you are not redirecting your uh, my shopify domain to your actual domain then you can just make it like this okay so here it is like a four domain plus two if you have my shopify domain which is not redirect user to the normal domain Okay, so that's the thing. Now you can test it on the front end and it will work for you. Let me know if you have anything else. Our live chat is there. You can just send me the message and we will help you with that setup. Thank you.